All right, everybody, we're doing a post-Halloween check-in on Green Phantom, a.k.a. King Cobra JFS. He had a content blowout yesterday, except also not really. I mean, there's a lot quantity and time-wise, but, uh, you know, it's not necessarily the most rich basically boy was looking pretty sad for a lot of the halloween evening maybe because he had nothing going on and it's his favorite holiday maybe because there's rumors about now coming back to casper very soon i'm not sure how that would possibly happen but it's People are saying it as they tend to do. Yesterday, he uploaded two videos pre-Green Phantom and then did three live streams. An hour and 45 with the Green Phantom thing on. Happy Halloween, 55 minutes, and then chilling for over five hours. And uh, a lot of that time was spent watching videos. He was just watching videos, like clips of like Family Guy and South Park and whatever, saying nothing, just looking really sad. So I, I don't think he had the best Halloween, but uh, let's uh, go through what we can here. I definitely want to check out the fan mail. Boy got his P.O. box set up and went to it, picked up some things for a special Halloween treat, I guess. And try to go to some key moments of the live streams, check out the Green Phantom costume, which, by the way, there's the Green Phantom t-shirt he said he was going to make. He was just waiting till Halloween to put the costume on to take a crappy picture to make a shirt that says Happy Halloween the day after Halloween. Didn't think that through, did you? Maybe it's for next year. Getting ahead of the game here. Fan mail video. Let's check this out, and then we'll analyze some of those live streams. Yo, but your boy King Cobra back at it with another video. And if you want to send me some cool stuff to my P.O. Box, it's P.O. Box 50564. Casper Wyoming 826. I believe he does address the wendy's sentinel and stuff in this so there's that up. it's halloween speaking of the p.o box what do we I have a box of stuff right here what's in this box i wonder quietly to myself it is a miserably hot day here in new jersey uh on, in november it's november 1st it's like 80 degrees today and the apartment complex has the heat on and i have no control over it but i don't think i don't know where the hell like the thermostat is that determines when the heat kicks on like maybe it's like in the basement was there like a boiler room or something i don't know but i don't think like the heaters are going right now so i, I put the ac on i don't know if it's just gonna counter it or what but can't deal with it sorry that's just that's just where i'm at just as, as a basis alcohol oh Oh, wow. Jimmy. Contributing to that, huh? <laughs> it's going to be a wild Halloween. Four shooters in here. I've got some Jim Beam, some Evan Williams, and some whatever the f*** this is. I don't know these people. I don't know Jim. What else? Oh, my God. He's really tearing that apart. What else? I got another shooter. What do we got? Another Evan Williams shooter. Oh boy. And then what do we have in here? A can of some sort. Better not contribute to the boys' drinking problem. So what's up to put on the old costume? The, the old green phantom. No frosties this year. Damn shame. A cotton candy IPA flavored beer. Now that sounds delicious. That's a little warm. I might oh, have to put cotton candy that beer in the fridge. The boy's gonna yeah, chill a drink. Big old bottle of Fireball. That's what's up. Oh my yeah, god. Yes, so I never got enough. Uh, I'd say I got enough alcohol for the uh, Halloween night. Yeah, you know, I really hope that is enough for Halloween night. My God. Hopefully that is plenty for one night. Oh, boy. That's most definitely that'll, what's up. That'll last the night. Cigars inside. Well, then. Oh, boy. All of the all of life's pleasures in this uh, P.O. box. Yeah, 
You know a note that comes with it? You know a note? Oh, damn. <laughs> just, just, just supply him with uh, his his tools of destruction here, and uh, don't even say hi. <laughs> damn. What is it? Check out these cigars. I can't see them. Sweet. We got two cigars called the Free Will Cigars, and I'm not sure what this other label is. Beautiful mm -hmm. YouTube. Okay. That's what's the f***s tubes Better from not... cigarpage.com for smoking. Thank you. For smoking? Thank you for smoking? And seriously, thank you to the fans who sent me all this awesome stuff in the mail. I greatly appreciate it. Anything else? And put these... A wad of cash, perhaps? Real quick. Clop over to the uh, fridge with his, his, his cloven hooves and a uh, little bell around his neck. <laughs> well, those get a little bit cold before I start sipping. Better not be aesthetically representative of cattle. There, boy. It didn't come with a note or anything, so thank you to whoever sent that was or this. It was me. No. Oi, wrap it up. My God, what is he doing? That's enough alcohol for the evening. I don't need to order any. I got plenty in that care package. God, I hope that lasts more than an evening. I really do. Check out these cigars, man. That'll last the evening. Let's try one out on the camera real quick. Oh, boy. Give it the old one-two, see how it do. He's Let's having a very slow-moving Halloween. Jeez. The hype is dead. Cigars ripping. Need my cigar cutter. Hmm... God. That is the question of the century, is it not, folks? Like, where did Cobra put his cigar cutter at? Probably with the uh, can opener. Leave it on my desk. <laughs> Cowbell ring and dingin'. Oh my god, now I know why people don't usually watch his stuff raw. <laughs> the space in between things happening is unbearable. There's my cigar cutter. Remember that like, fat cigar in a hot minute? Not sure what the brand of this is, but let's just open it and find out, shall we? Better not suck on a fat cigar, boy. I gotta stop. It's really so, yeah, getting I'll try old, to that get joke. As much as I can. Oh, 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 oh. That's a nice fat stogie. A little sus, dude. It you... smells really good. Okay, let's look, look for our cap. You see the cap on the end right there? Right, the, that little line right there? Yeah. You want to cut before that line when you're cutting a cigar. Okay, thanks. What if I don't? Oh, God. Don't get your willy in that. Man, he's really moved up in the world from uh, pulling pulling tobacco out of used cigarette butts he finds on 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 the ground. But it's cut. Do a dry puff on it real quick. Okay. All right, I'm liking the flavor. I could use a lighter to light it, but I'm gonna use a match instead. Wow. Oh. Better not burn down the trailer, the three bedroom. <laughs> I don't know. If, I don't know if this is gonna work. Yeah, that's not gonna happen. <laughs> I like his focused face, the eyebrows. Toast it. Hey. Better not suck on that. I gotta stop. I gotta stop. It's just taking over my life. Oh my God. Give it a second. Give it a second. Give it a second. Oh my God. Good. 
God, is it supposed to be this much of a struggle here? All right, got ourselves a little bit of alcohol and a Halloween cigar. Let's see how it do. <laughs> it's going to be a night. This is the, the quality content that I really hope for. Spe the Halloween special. That's a tasty cigar. I just want to say thank you to the fans for the awesome support and happy Halloween. There you go. How many more days until this room is just completely yellow? <laughs> until there's just a layer of soot on everything. Oh, damn. It's still going? That's crazy. Thought he was getting ready to wrap it up. She's a-rolling. That's what's up. Okay. Hopefully that window's open. They're going to check out the Happy Halloween stream real quick. I'm sure I'll be skipping around to the good bits. Oh, damn. Very spooky. Greetings, fellow YouTubers. The green phantom strikes again. I feel like you should like, have the light off or Happy something. Halloween, you flankers. <laughs> really kills the vibe to have the ceiling lights on. Hope you all have a fantastic Halloween. This would make a great costume. I should have like, I should Happy like Halloween. Happy found where I can get this stuff Happy from. Halloween. I have a uh, beer to try on camera. Fermentorium cotton candy. I think his whole trailer should be called the Fermentorium. Yes, I can drink with the mask on. Oh, I don't know about that. It's going to drown in it. Oh, oh, yeah. Okay, so clearly not. He's, he's like, <laughs> oh, that does not count. Come on. Oh, it's got a whole thing to it and everything. Oh, and that's it. I for can the drink with the mask on, but I don't want to like spill it all over the place. I don't know. Sounds like, you can't. Halloween costume, yeah. Sounds like you can't drink with the mask on. It is. So a cotton candy beer? Sounds like a drink combo on its own. Thanks, Sage. Okay, that's good beer for 21 and up. Do you have any beer for not 21 and up? <laughs> Thank you, Russian, for your donation. Happy Halloween. I believe he also talks about getting the wand out to Beverly, finally. I am going to be releasing a brand new Green Phantom t-shirt tomorrow, which will come out right this evening. I'll be getting Beverly's wand mailed out tomorrow. I didn't get to it today because wow. I had counseling. Today's the day. Also, hey, he went to counseling. Take that, Nal. Clint is doing everything he can. You never got him to counseling, huh? Okay, fair excuse for not getting the wand out today. He had to go to counseling. I mean, it would have been a great opportunity to hit up the post office real quick on the way there. But you know what? It's probably a lot for him. But today's the day, You're then. Thanks for tuning in to watch me go live. Today's the sending the wand day. No, I did not send Jessica the Wendy's. I don't know who sent her that, but they're happy for doing it. <laughs> <laughs> Why? Because they were pretending it's you? No, I'm not going to Frosty's. I pretty much avoided that place. After that one Halloween. I'm not sad, I'm just hanging out. <laughs> yeah, I don't know, he does seem pretty sad for the rest of the day here. This face that he has on right now is pretty much his exact expression for like most of the night. Except like a little slightly more tired and forlorn as it goes on. Did you send Jessica Wendy, someone says. No, I did not, Dirty Goblin, I did not. <laughs> I can't stand Jessica Boyle. Okay, thanks for clearing that up. Actually, I ruled Jessica Boyle's life, otherwise she would get over me, dude. Clearly. I did not send her that crap. I was one of my fast YouTube trolls. It's okay if you sent her Wendy's as a consolation prize. You're gonna talk to you're just gonna get banned from the channel. Damn. I'm not down and depressed, I'm just hanging out. He seems pretty depressed. Jessica's beyond crazy, dude. I can't stand her. Great. I did not send her that crap. I can't stand Jessica Boyle. I did, however, send her a cow costume from the Halloween store, which I thought was kind of hilarious. Sent her a cow costume from the Halloween store? Bro, this is not being over it and wishing she would leave you alone. Hey, Tucker. That's so, like, mean. It was set, sent with such ill intent. Sent her a cow costume? Bro, that just proves that you're thinking about her. What the hell? She's a miserable cow. Oh my god. I also sent her some bacterial vaginal stuff. Bro, you're obsessed. She rules your sad, pathetic life. Oh my god. And what else did I send her? Uh, these laxatives you shove in your ass. <laughs> what? 
What is wrong with this guy? What does that even have to do with anything? What the hell? I don't miss her. I sent her those crap to troll her, dude. I can't stand Jessica Boyle. Bro, it's obsessed with her. You got a cow costume, some uh, things you insert for laxatives, and some of the bacterial. That's crazy. Dude's obsessed. Oh my god, is this a cry for help? How does it make me a hypocrite when she won't leave me alone? Plus, trolling Jessica Boyle is actually kind of fun, just to watch her lose her on camera. Where does this end, then? Tucker, it's fine if you're going to scratch the back of my chair. Just make sure it's not the green screen. This green Jessica screen... Jessica Boyle dog. Tucker, this green screen cost like as much as like your adoption paperwork so just kidding it's fun to threaten your pets boxes me all the time so f her i wonder if he's going to address the uh leaked photos situation no she did not tailgate i don't want to talk about that fact on my youtube channel dude who gives a about like jessica boyle and clearly you little jessica's delusional she needs to leave me alone <laughs> Bro, leave her alone. For the last time, I'm not depressed. If I was depressed, I'd talk to someone about it. Jesus Christ. <laughs> I guess that's the running theme for today. Why so sad, Cobra? You know what necrophiliacs and alcoholics have in common? They both like to crack open a cold one. Oh. Oh. Okay. He's, he's, he's got Halloween jokes, I guess. Jessica Boyle did not ruin that movie. Although, if you want to say, sit there and go, Oh, Josh, I'd love to watch Tombstone with you. He'll you never get over her ruining the Tombstone watching. Watch it with me. Insufferable, dude. Oh, God. And I did press charges on her for revenge porn. I mean, the cops didn't do anything about it. So I'm like, that's great. That's been great. Silence the victim, right? And then you got your own revenge, or? If the Jessica Boyle situation were gender reversed, I'd be the biggest ass pig. And people love to say, well, that's always Josh's go-to. Yep. That's all, and it's not a go-to, it's the truth, dude. <sighs> if it were gender reversed, oh, that's always Josh's go-to. I'm like, no, it's the truth. I'm not afraid to call it out like I see it. Women have no problems calling out men when they pull this crap. And no, no oh one checks God. them on it and says, you're just nagging. Check your female privilege. All women I don't know, why is he acting like people think all the things Jessica is doing is okay. Like, no one is legitimately saying, like, I'm sure there's trolls that are like, hey, man, leave her alone. She didn't do anything wrong just to mess with him. But, like, I don't think the general public is like, hey, Jessica didn't do anything to you, bro. Women want his dick. Oh. You never hear him say that. All women want his dick. You never hear him say that. Or that's, dude. That's, that's crazy. Okay, looks like we've got an extended gender relations conversation about women going to war and stuff okay and then i guess he's just watching some videos looking sad what's the matter boy and then yeah i think he just continues watching stuff for a while the the following happy halloween stream i don't know if it got disconnected or what you said it froze the person that took that photo shame on you because you should have been going up oh to her and, and telling her that she had that after you took the he's photo. just watching more stuff everyone's saying you look sad other reproductive harm so right there is one hell of a disclaimer and clearly that's just sad man i'm so glad i quit huffing air duster yeah damn like i used to have a really bad addiction to huffing air duster i do like four to eight cans a day and it wasn't getting me high four to eight cans a day of duster and it wasn't doing anything to him that is harrowing it's terrifying it's like it's like there was no brain cells left to actually have an effect on at that point like my god no wonder he's so bummed out that i and then here's the start of the five hour stream and look at look at his face at the beginning of it bro what's wrong my god Oh boy, his audio is so bad. The volume sucks. Let me skip around this. See. I'm gonna be live for much longer. I might go live till about like maybe ten thirty ish. Call it quits for the. Maybe live for much longer. Five hours. Let's let's we'll skip around. Tired of politics and how you can't support certain candidates without people losing their. Sh well, yeah. <laughs> Oh my god, what does this country come to? Oh, you can't be racist anymore without people getting all on your case about it? Sheesh. 
<laughs> can't, can't I hate in peace? Never had Popeyes. We don't have that in Casper. Okay. Paper boy, pizza factory worker, fast food worker. What about it? Dishwasher, famous YouTuber. Oh, that was his, that's his 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 path of careers. Indeed, Logan. Cheers for the legendary Aussie. Hope y'all having a fantastic Halloween. Let's let's go another hour in here. Green Phantom costume back on. Oh oh oh! Wow, very talented. Oh. Oh my god, spooky. And then they hear me going off like I thought I told these goddamn YouTube trolls to suck my butt crap while I fart in their mouth. Bro's gonna get a strike again. And I'll catch them like walking their dog and then like they start laughing their asses off. They're like, it's butt crack guy. <laughs> Talk about his neighbors hearing his antics. <laughs> okay, dude. Satan's Bell album cover. So nice, uh. Let's see how we're doing four hours in. No, I mean, I am going to get a protection order against Jessica Boyle. No, you I'm won't. I'm going to figure out how you do that. And then you won't be able to send her a cow costume anymore. I'm going to get the wand in the mail, of course. Or sanitary One needs. One day at a time, you know. The first wand in the mail, then restraining order. And the Got fact it. that I have to consider getting a protection order against Jessica is beyond sad. Now, Jessica Boyle truly loved Josh and truly missed me. She quit talking about me on her channel. She Third quit talking shit and spread lies about me just to feed the trolls because she wants attention and interaction. And the only way she gets interaction on her YouTube channel is if she talks about me. Sure. Because no one else outside of that gives it. I was like, oh, look, Jessica Boyle being blackout drunk, sitting on her parents' toilets, screaming about how much she hates Josh and what a sicko he is, and blah, blah, blah. And it's like, bro, you are still hard for his c holy sh Great. A shot of Jack Daniels together. I don't okay, let's get ahead here. You hit women, you're a f dude. You beat oh. your mom, too. Oh. And then if you try pulling up the excuse that, well, she hit me first and it's self defense, they call you a man child and tell you to grow up. What? I'm like, funny how the argument flips when it's like expected of men to be tougher than chicks. And then when you get your ass kicked by a chick, you're immediately demasculated. <laughs> what is this fictional scenario he's making up? Who's making this up? This isn't a thing happening to him. Why is he mad? <laughs> Listening to some music. One, if you're pissed off. Press two, if you want to hear the main menu options in a different language. Press three, if you feel like tearing your hair out and smashing your head into a brick wall. Press four, if you feel like smashing your phone into the next day was concrete. Press five, if you're sick and tired of telemarketers. Press is this, six, if you is, want. Is this just things that go on in his head? Give a telemarketer a piece of your mind. Press seven, if you'd like to follow it up by a huge juicy fart from your nasty ass on the phone. You showed those trolls. You'll get mad at women when they just see you as a money object and as a uh, child support payment bank machine waiting to happen oh my god but when you treat them like they're sex objects you're no better than they are oh my god this guy women is... are constantly screaming about how they don't need a man in their life and i'm like bull bull the minimum wage gap is sexist and if women didn't have the ability you're talking about to... the gender wage gap not the minimum wage what divorce men for child support payments they would be miserable oh my god i mean it's not anything new but this guy hates women so much it's crazy it's like you want to scream at me about how sexist the minimum wage gap is i'm like well when when men are expected to pay for everything and women cost more money god i hope the counseling is for his anger against the women sexism does play a part in that in that role yes but at the same time it's like men are expected to pay for everything no. and women cost more money and, be, uh. and on top of that men are more likely to take on more traditional like dangerous roles when it comes to the job so there's Brother, multiple factors. You're a YouTuber. There's better in play here. It's not just. This isn't about you. Better sex is trash. Women hating pieces of shit. And you know what kills me about double standards is like if women hate men, you can't call it out because you're.
Shaming and you're a sexist, but when what are you talking about? It doesn't make any sense. Gender reverse. It's like, oh well, you're a piece of sh for hating women. I'm like, wait a minute. So it's okay for women to hate me, but I can't hate them back. I'm personally like, screw that. <laughs> what is he? These these are fictional people. No one's saying this. I don't hate people based off their gender. That's he he loves do. hating people he made up. Feel about it. Thank you. I do not hate people based off their gender. I hate people based off of how they treat others and how they treat myself. Whether okay. or not you're a sicko, because I hate sickos. <laughs> I mean, am I, am I the bad guy here for being like, you know what, I'm not gonna judge you outside of being a sicko and how you treat me and other people. No, I'm not wrong for saying that, because it's the truth. And it's like, you know what, when you can just like, step back for a second, sip on your drink and watch Beavis and Butthead and realize how incredibly stupid it is. Like that's the whole that's the whole shtick for Beavis yeah. and Butthead. It's like Okay, whatever. <laughs> I, think, my pro I think he's just I think he's just like watching Beavis and Butthead. Pronouns would go f yourself. Mean. <laughs> okay, and that's that's his Halloween. Gotta be his saddest Halloween yet. At least the getting kicked out of Frosty's year had some action in it, you know? Man, bring us back to the good old days, you know? Ugh. What up, YouTube? King Cobra JFS back at it with another video. So yeah, I'm just sitting here. Uh, rest in peace, Queen Elizabeth II. I got a little something to toast her off. Inside. Wow. Incredible. I feel sad about that because, you know, I'm 80% British myself. And, uh, well, she had she had people that cared about her, you know? You can say what you want about the royal family, but... Oh my god, what a noble, noble boy that is. What happened? What happened to that boy? Alright, that's, that's uh, the post-Halloween check-in for you, I guess. <laughs> Hope you enjoyed it. I can't believe he admitted to sending now a cow costume some antibacterial sanitary products and like like some kind of like enema very weird dude um it's not gonna not gonna help in your like restraining order case and and the leaked photos case and whatever but uh good luck <laughs> yeah all right thanks so much we'll see you for the next one bye bye